you know, it's just starting to heat up around here. And you know what? So are the game releases. With E3 just around the corner with even more games to look forward to, here are the hottest games that you can keep an eye out for right now. Despite consecutive delays, Naughty Dog finally returns with one of PlayStation's greatest heroes this month, Nathan Drake, and Uncharted 4 A Thief's End. Deemed the fourth and final addition to the series, things pick up years after Uncharted 3 when Drake gets a pretty crazy surprise from none other than his brother. With the two together again, adventure ensues following the conspiracy behind Libertalia and tons of pirate treasure. What's already being rumored as the longest title from the series, even featuring a bit of open world and online multiplayer player fun, it will all be available exclusively for PlayStation fans this May 10th. Nice and what was once known as Doom 4 is now known simply as the first person shooter named Doom, and it's back with a vengeance too for the first time since 2004. Simply put, it's demons, guns, and lots of fast movement, and fans will see the return of tons of classic weapons, enemies, and more, from super shotguns to cyber demons. It's a game that'll take a lot of fast thought as it's fast paced and full of crazy combat, featuring an all new melee execution system, a campaign more than 13 hours long, and the return of classic multiplayer modes with 9 maps available at launch. It all goes down on Xbox One, PS4, and PC this May 13th. But now it's 2029 and we're four years into the invasion of the United States by the Greater Korean Republic. Sound kind of familiar? Yep, Homefront is back with Homefront the Revolution. The GKR have taken base in Philadelphia and armies are constantly running the streets. But a rebellion is brewing and that's where you come in. Follow Ethan and the rest of the resistance as they attempt to take the city back in a different kind of Homefront game. See this time it's open world. Explore districts, scavenge parts, and build or even now modify your weapons as you lead the fight to take back the three districts. Play the campaign in even a four-player co-op multiplayer mode in Homefront's latest on Xbox One, PS4, and PC this May 17th. Seems like it's a month of comebacks and this time it's Mirror's Edge Catalyst. Rebooting the popular 2008 title, Catalyst will focus this time on Faith's origin as she attempts to take down multiple corporations ruling the city of glass. Staying true to its classic first person gameplay, players will be able to traverse through and solve missions using parkour and a little brute force to knock out enemies. Use the environment around you to reach new heights and runner vision to help lead the way in what is now an open world free roaming environment. With a new combat system, a multiplayer game that affects the world for other players, and much more, you can try your hand at the City of Glass on Xbox One, PS4, or PC this May 24th. And lastly, it's a different kind of multiplayer first person shooter this month in the form of Overwatch, Keep the Peace Against the Uprising of Robots. It's a game that focuses more on working together as each player is able to take on the role of a different character, each with their own unique abilities and roles. So everybody has to play their part to help their team come out on top. It's two teams of six going head to head across three game modes, Assault, Escort, and Control. Will you choose to be a part of the offense, defense, support, or maybe you'll just want to be a tank? Who knows until you get down to the nitty gritty this May 24th on Xbox One, PS4, and PC. Well there you have it, there's a look at some of the hottest games coming out this May. And we've got even more like news, reviews, and more regarding all of these coming you already know where, Digital Trends.